Good morning, guys. Um, Stuffy Nose Marcy here, and um, I, I, I said in my on my last video on um, that I was gonna do a tutorial on how I made that page. Well, you're asking yourself, well, Marcy, what are you doing with that crazy big um, arrow or envelope thing on top of your desk? Well, this is how I made it. So it's an envelope. And um, it's a, just a normal one that I bought some Christmas cards and I had these envelopes left. And the Christmas cards, because I didn't use them, I ended up made, making my own. But um, yeah, so this is the envelope. And what you, what I did is I, I kind of unstuck it because I coffee dyed it. And the glue on my oven just, it doesn't work even better for me because um, I get to use my good glue for them but for the sake of this tutorial I'm gonna use my ATG gun so sorry if I'm running out of breath it's just it's early morning here it's like nine o'clock and and yeah allergies my windows open I need to air my room it smells weird after you wake up you know it smells like nighttime sweaty pajamas Stuffy nose allergies kind of cave. <laughs> so I think I didn't refill it properly. And I just refilled it. So I did something wrong. But whatever. Okay. So hold on. I'm going to close my envelope the way it was before. And I hope I'm on camera. Okay. So you just close your envelope. Ugh. I'm gonna take the extra glue that I applied here out so it's not sticky. Okay. And then you fold it, but you have to not adhere it. So you fold it and then you fold it in the middle. And this is how you got your page one pocket here. And then you get your little roundy thingy <clears throat> and you punch a hole there like this boom so you end up with um, a pocket in the middle right there and then a pocket over here but if you want to take it um, a step, um, a little bit a step farther, you get your cutter thingy, mine's backwards, of course, because when you do a tutorial, this happens, and you chop this right here, and right here, and I'm going to finish cutting this one with my scissors, because it was really, really little. Like the little paper that I cut. And they look weird. So that's what you do. So if this was going to be part of your journal. Um, what you do is. You will open it and sew through the middle. And then close it. And leave it like that. And then <clears throat> you will have like pages here. So this will be like a photo mat. And then this will be the pocket. And that way, um, you have stuff in the middle, and this doesn't have to go in the middle. You know what I mean? Like, let's see. If you had, like, a page here, you just open it, open it, then you have another one. So you had two different pockets. But if you don't want to have it like that in your journal, and you want to have it in the middle, you have the option of putting tape around the little hole here, just around it, and down here, and then glue it, and that way you'll have... A pocket here you know in the middle of those two because these will be glued and a pocket up here and another pocket in the back here so there you go so let's just pretend this is like a normal page kind of thing and I'll be sticking this in here no probably this one I'll be sticking here because it's my big pocket there and then probably I'll have this tag here and I'll add a little bit of my glue 
down here. Wait, there's a blob there. And the glue doesn't work. There we go. And then just glue it on the bottom here, in that little corner. And then flip it around. Glue my other corner. Uh, I can barely see. In there. And maybe have another one of those here. And another one of these big tags here. And another little jar. So I'll probably just leave it as that. Then have this with pages in the middle. So I hop to different pockets. And probably put a butterfly here. I don't know. Something like that. So this is um, how you do it. Then if you have your envelope punch board. <clears throat> which I do. I just got it recently. Like two months ago or something like that. And I love it. So, and if you have your envelope punch board, um, it's really cool because you make the envelope any, any size you want, and then, um, you just have to, you can chop this corner off, I don't, I, I don't care about that corner because it's going to be glued, so, my glue gun, basically just do the same thing, and just glue it like you would a normal envelope like that and then remember to leave this one open and then you fold it in half if you wanted to make this lines more um, like visualize it more you could actually ink it so I'm gonna just ink it a little bit Just ink it a bit. Well, it failed. Sorry about that noise. So, there you go. You have your pocket. And so, again, this will be a pocket. This will be another pocket. <clears throat> and you can have it close. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to um, not use this part as a pocket, but the part in the middle, and I'm just going to glue it here, so, okay, let's see if I can do this, um, I'm going to add a page to the thing with this, so, <clears throat> I'm going to use my good glue for this, let's see how much time I, I have left, okay, so, Let's see, no, that's too thick. Okay, so. Just add a glue there. And some more glue here. There. My glue or sticky tape or whatever you want to add to the thing. Okay, wait. This is going to go here. Okay, so there's uh, my flippy page thing with my pocket. And I have to... Yeah, I'm going to actually use those pockets. Yes, I'm going to. But it's have two pockets in one, right? So I'm just gonna chop a little bit off. Just to open the envelope on this side. And instead of punching two holes, I'm gonna punch that one in there. And then one over here. I'm not good at tutorials, guys, so I'm sorry. And then I'm gonna seal the entire thing. Well, if I seal it, then I won't be able to use it. Well, this can be a card or just an insert. I was gonna say, if I'm gonna use it in a mini album, if I glue it, I'm not gonna be able to use it anymore. 
so there we are. And then I'm just gonna add some of the decoration thingies here. This is a little mini book you see, it's got vapor in there. Let me see if I can open it. So it's just, you know, for quotes or whatever I want. So that's gonna go in there, like that. And then you have a big pocket here. And I'm gonna stick a picture of Nicholas when he was a baby. So there, you have a picture there. Then you flip it. You can actually add some sticky stuff in here, probably like a clip or whatever you feel like adding. And then you open it, you have space for journaling too. And then more little tags that go in there. Like that kind of thing. Oh, wait. Like that. And then you have another pocket here. So you can add more journaling if you like. Nah. So there we go. And if you had sewn here before gluing it like I did, then wait, let me. I have boogies, sorry. Oh god. <sighs> I'm always, it's always my nose. It's like, I'm like Rudolph Marcy. Little red nose Rudolph. Oh god. Sorry about that. So, yeah. So, pocket, pocket, page, pocket, pocket. And you can make a, a whole mini album out of just envelopes that you make out of your own papers with your envelope punch board or out of like normal um, envelopes that you buy at the store and you just have to paper piece it to put it you know to give it a strength but here's my little tutorial and I hope that helped you don't need much to do it nation and a little some cutouts and whatever you want to add to them okay guys um thanks for watching and see you later bye